How to create an NFT. What is an NFT? A non-fungible token or NFT is a unique digital file stored on a blockchain or a digital ledger. An NFT is a cryptographic token, but unlike cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin and many other network or utility tokens, NFTs are not mutually interchangeable, i.e. not fungible. So in simpler terms, NFTs are digital assets that contain identifying data recorded in smart contracts. This is via the Ethereum blockchain ledger. So it's like owning a rare baseball card in a digital format, and the ledger shows a record that you own that NFT, and it shows who previously owned that NFT, all on that ledger. So as you can see, I clicked a CryptoPunk NFT for sale on the OpenSea Marketplace website, and under the trading history section, I can see the blockchain ledger recorded each transaction of this NFT from Ether Wallet to Ether Wallet. So, as you can see, there was a transfer from this wallet to another wallet, a sale, a bid, an initial listing by a wallet, all tracked on the Ethereum blockchain ledger. Now let's discuss how to buy and sell NFTs on OpenSea. You can create an NFT for free on the website OpenSea.io. All you need to get started is a crypto wallet. We suggest and personally use MetaMask. You will need to create a MetaMask wallet and fund it with Ethereum ETH, before buying and selling on OpenSea. MetaMask is the oldest, most trusted crypto wallet online. So navigate to metamask.io and click the download button. Then select your desktop browser or mobile device you want to install it on. For this example, we will install the MetaMask wallet in our Chrome browser via the MetaMask Chrome extension. So I'll click that add button in the Chrome web store. Once installed, a new tab will open up in the Chrome browser, welcoming you to MetaMask. Click the get started button. Click that Create a Wallet button. Next, you'll be given your seed phrase for this wallet. This is a backup phrase in case you need to open your MetaMask wallet on another device or lose access to this computer. So you'll need to write down these secret words in the correct order and save them in a safe location. I like to save multiple backups in multiple places and never share the phrase with anyone. Compare this to your credit card number. You want the words in the correct order in order to access your wallet. You now have created a MetaMask Ethereum wallet and you can start sending and receiving Ethereum. You can also click that Add Token button at the bottom to add other cryptocurrencies to your wallet. But for OpenSea, we'll only need Ethereum. In order to buy, create, and sell NFTs on OpenSea, you'll need to have some Ethereum in your wallet. So your wallet is that 0x and then it's a long stream of numbers, that number is your Ethereum wallet. That's unique to you. So click that wallet to copy it, and now you've copied your wallet address. This is where you need to send Ethereum. You need to fund this wallet. So it's like moving money from another wallet to this. So we'll go buy Ethereum on an exchange and transfer it to this wallet for storage and spending on OpenSea. So to learn how to buy and send cryptocurrency, plus get a free $10 in Bitcoin, read our in-depth guide at coursenvy.com slash Coinbase. Create your OpenSea account. Now go to OpenSea.io, click the profile image in the top right corner. This will take you to your OpenSea.io slash wallet URL. Click the sign in button to sign into your MetaMask wallet. Select the Ethereum wallet you just created with MetaMask, then click the Next button, then click the Connect button. You are now connected to your MetaMask Ethereum wallet. Click the Sign In button once again to be redirected to your OpenSea profile for this Ethereum wallet. As you can see, we're on our OpenSea.io slash account page. Here you can edit your profile, which is image, your profile name, and you can see the NFTs in your account, or this specific Ethereum wallet address. 
As you can see, we haven't bought or sold any NFTs yet, so there's no matching items in this account. Now it's time to create your first NFT. Click the Create option in the top right menu, and then in that dropdown, select My Collections. Now at the OpenSea.io slash Collections URL, you'll be prompted to create a new collection. Click that Create button. Create a collection. On this page, agree to the OpenSea Terms of Service. Once you click that Create New Collection button, and then sign in with your specific Ethereum wallet. Now to create even a single NFT, you'll need to first create a collection. Think of this as your brand name for your NFTs. So what's your brand logo? What's your brand name? What's your brand description? An example of a collection is CryptoPunks. Your new collection will appear here. Now we need to request review for this collection. So click on your new collection. Next, you'll submit your OpenSea collection for review to be verified on the OpenSea Marketplace. So on this collection page, click Edit. On this page, you can edit your NFT collection details, such as name, URL, website, Twitter account. So scroll down on this page and toggle on the Submit for Review, and then click the Submit Changes button. Now it's time to create an item, or an NFT. So navigate to your My Collections page via the Create. In the drop-down, My Collections, click on the collection you want to create an NFT in. On the, your collection page, click the Add New Item button. It is on this page you'll create your first NFT. So as you can see, this can be an image, a video, audio, a 3D model. All these file types up to 100 megabytes are accepted. So drag and drop that NFT art there, name it, include an external link if it has one, and then a description. So scroll down here. Once ready, click the Create button to create this NFT. Your new NFT will now appear on your collections page under the items section. Now it's time to sell an NFT. To sell an NFT, simply click the NFT item on your collection page. On the actual NFT page, click that sell button in the top right corner. Set your price for this NFT, then click the post your listing button. Before you can list an item for sale or accept an offer on OpenSea, you'll need to set yourself up for trading. While there's no charge from OpenSea, you will have to pay a one-time gas fee. This is the Ethereum network transaction cost to initialize your wallet on the blockchain. Once you've initialized your account, you can post your listing for free. You will only be charged a fee by OpenSea once you sell the NFT. This is a 2.5% commission. How to buy an NFT. Buying an NFT is as simple as searching OpenSea for an item you want, then bidding, buying now, or making an offer. Once you decide to buy an NFT, you'll be connected with your MetaMask wallet, and you will have to confirm your purchase. Once you complete your purchase, the NFT you purchased will permanently be connected to your wallet address and OpenSea profile until you choose to sell that NFT. And remember, your wallet address will track this record showing the trading history of this NFT. So to learn more about this and sign up for our free cryptocurrency course and claim $10 in free Bitcoin, head over to CourseEnvy.com and submit your email address. Thanks for checking out Course Envy. Please take one second to like, subscribe, and comment anything below. These three things are the key to getting your videos to rank higher in YouTube search results.